upgraded Greek airbase caters to growing interest for U.S. drones. Several U.S. MQ-9 Reaper drones have found a new home base at the newly upgraded Larissa Air Base in Greece, as American military officials keep an eye on the southern border. Work on the base near the east coast of the Aegean will last for most of 2022. It is slated to include new maintenance shelters, ramps and a taxiway extension, with a $21 million local construction contract to be completed in the last few weeks. This modernization coincides with the arrival of a number of Reaper unmanned aerial vehicles at Greek airfields, as reported by Reporter Greece in late November. A spokesperson for the U.S. Air Force in Europe Africa confirmed the arrival to Defense News, saying the U.S. and Greece are working closely to ensure the Larissa base has the capability to support the MQ-9. Larissa Air Base is a strategic location, enabling the MQ-9 to easily support the eastern and southern flanks of NATO, the spokesman said. The move to get them there aims to support prevention and avoid conflict. Officials declined to specify the number of drones based at the installation, citing operational security, although local reports put it at 8. Their deployment was authorized under amendments made to the U.S.-Greek Mutual Defense Cooperation Agreement dating back to 1990. Among those changes, the last approved in 2021, Washington is now permitted to conduct at Larissa Air Base and Stefan Avakio Army Aviation. Based on the following missions, operation, maintenance and support of patrol aircraft, some technical processing on the ground, and maintenance and support of airlift and logistics support, including tanker aircraft. The Greek military itself is also trying to get the MQ-9 drone. Athens submitted an acquisition program for these three systems to its Parliamentary Armaments Committee, which was approved in July 2022.